Hi, my name is Kathy de los Rios, and I'm an assistant professor at the University of California, Davis. I'm excited to discuss my article, co-authored with Ethnic Studies teacher Arturo Molina, in the Journal of Literacy Research, titled Literacies of Refuge, Pidiendo Posadas as Ritual of Justice. In this piece, we respond to Lee Patel's 2018 call in JLR to imagine schools and literacy as sanctuary and to work to provide concrete practices that schools and teachers can engage to stand more deeply in solidarity with migrant communities. We report on a transformative social design experiment called Las Posadas and is an ongoing partnership between a high school Chicanx Latinx studies class and immigrant day laborers, parents, and advocates of the greater immigrant rights movement. Our paper demonstrates how a high school ethnic studies unit taught by my co-author, Mr. Molina, leveraged immigrant families' literacies rooted in the Mexican spiritual ritual of Las Posadas for in-school literacy instruction and to engage in processions with local day laborers as a form of collective social protest. Social scientists have studied the astute ways that immigrant communities innovate strategies for sanctuary types of checkpoints. Our paper draws from these literatures to showcase how Mr. Molina engaged in sanctuary-based curriculum making, addressing many of these complex issues through mobilizing students' translanguaging and using translingual texts, literature, and corridos, as well as having students engage in research processes that allowed them to investigate some of their some of the primary myths about immigrant communities that are not only harmful but also false. Students' research was shared uh, at the culminating posadas that students organized with the Day Labor Center. And while the course is technically an English medium course, Mr. Molina's students were all bilingual or emergent bilingual and came from mixed status families themselves. And so this paper asks, what do literacies look like in an ethnic studies course that design learning around local community knowledge and sanctuary? And secondly, how do students respond to such curricular designing? Our inquiry weaves the literatures of cultural modeling, translanguaging, and lived civics with immigrant family social movement research. We use participatory design research and ethnographic methods to hone in on the year immediately after Donald Trump's election, focusing in on the posadas that took place in December of 2017. Our study presents what we call literacies of refuge, or classroom approaches to reading, writing, speaking, and being that affirm the rights, dignity, humanity, legal protection, and futurity of migrant of significance. This research highlights the academic learning involved in naming and mobilizing politicized cultural data sets to the classroom, as well as a transformative potential of, tr of leveraging students' knowledge of contentious politics for literacy instruction. In closing, and in harmony with Lee Patel, we urge educators to conceive of school spaces and classrooms in more inclusive ways that span sanctuary-based curriculum making to grassroots community engagement with families. We hope you enjoy the article.